Hi, I'm Maureen Lawrence, an associate at Dick's Sporting Goods. Today, we're talking about baseball and softball batting helmets. Make sure you're suiting up with a helmet that is comfortable, fits properly, and above all else is safe. Batting helmets are made from a strong plastic material that helps protect the batter from wild pitches, hard tags, and miss throws. They not only cover your head, but your ears too. For more protection, you can consider getting a face mask, which is great for those who have braces. Chin straps are another available option, which helps stabilize a helmet that may be a bit loose. When you step into the batter's box, there should only be one thing on your mind, and that's knocking the ball out of the park. You don't want a poorly fitted batting helmet to interfere. When it comes to sizing, you'll find that buying a batting helmet is as easy as buying a fitted baseball cap. All you need to do is measure the circumference of your head and find the closest size available, which you can see on this size chart. When you put the helmet on, make sure the lid of the helmet sits an inch above your eyebrows. It should be even with the rest of your head. If it's tilted up like this, then you run the risk of taking a ball to the forehead when you're running the bases or batting. If it's tilted too far forward like this, the back of your head will be exposed. The last thing to look for is to make sure your helmet is approved by the National Operating Committee on Standards for Athletic Equipment. You can find this out by looking for the logo on the inside or the back of the helmet. This logo ensures that your helmet has met every one of the NOC SAE's high standards of protection. Every batting helmet at Dick's Sporting Goods is certified by the NOC SAE. Remember to take the time to check out your options when buying a batting helmet. Batter up.